Hey everyone, what is going on? So I have another video for you today in the Open Master League and these are battles that I did on stream and unfortunately because I did them on stream that means there's going to be a little bit of stutter lag. I gotta look at my internet, I gotta try and fix it. Uh, you know, I hate it but uh... I wanted to show you this because this is a really powerful team, but before we begin, I also want to let you know and I wanted to thank you all for helping donate towards my brother's kidney cancer. He does have kidney cancer and his surgery is going to be April 13th. It was originally scheduled for the 19th, but it was pushed up to the 13th, so we're all waiting for that. He has a lot of back pain, so we're all waiting for that surgery and I will post and let you all know how it goes. Thank you all so much for donating. If you are able to contribute, the link will be in the description down below uh, for the GoFundMe, but we really do appreciate that. But without further ado, let's go ahead and dive right into the battles. Uh, so the team is Dialga with Lugia as a safe swap and Giratina Origin. Great team, worked out really well. I climbed up over 100 points in one day, so really happy with that. Okay, going up against Groudon. So Groudon definitely wins this one. I tried to catch a press of his blades. I was not successful, so my opponent is going to go ahead and respond with a Dialga. Uh, as I said, you can see some of that stutter. Like, as I said, I don't, I don't think it's that bad, but still, you know, I, I understand it's a little bit annoying. So hopefully I get that internet fixed. Uh, but I do go ahead and pick up that shield. you love to see it. I'm trying to get to an Arrow Blast. Will my opponent throw a Draco? I'm going to go ahead and call the Iron Head. They do throw an Iron Head. They do live it. And Arrowblast coming out. No, my opponent gets to another Iron Head, but Lugia is such a tank. It lives this Iron Head, and I get off an Arrowblast anyway. Now, unfortunately, the Arrowblast is not going to KO. It almost does, but that is crazy. Lugia is such a tank. Uh, do I fall down with Giratina? No, I fall down with the Alga. Okay, so uh, that Groudon does have energy. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and throw my attack first because the Alga is going to be able to win CMP against the Groudon. Uh, and the Groudon lets it go. Uh, Groudon is going to be able to throw an attack right now. Do I let this one go? I do let it go. It's going to be in the Precipice Blades. Um, and I'm going to bring in my Giratina right now to go for the farm down. I am going to go ahead and invest the shield right now. Uh, it's going to be a fire punch. It's a nice bait. And guess what? There's a Mewtwo in the back looking pretty good. So that was a good fire punch bait by my opponent. But I'm going to be able to get off this Shadow Ball into the Mewtwo. My opponent going to go ahead and shield that one up. The beautiful thing is that Giratina does live with Precipice Blade, so even if my opponent gets to it with Groudon, uh, that's totally fine. Uh, it's going to be an Ice Beam, so that was a good shield by me. I'm going to go ahead and throw this attack. This is a Shundo, by the way. It's a lucky one I traded for. I tra It was a lucky. I just happened to go as a Shundo. We, we swapped, and it went as a Shundo. And I'm going to be able to take that one. Good game. Well played to my opponent. Again, I would have survived the Precipice Blades. Okay, the Algamira match. Um, okay. Not too bad. Uh, my opponent actually going to switch into Landorus. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and throw the Iron Head right now. Maybe to pick up an early shield. Um, do I switch into Giratina after this? My opponent does shield. I do switch in trying to catch a superpower. Uh, not able to catch it, but that's okay. This is going to be a Stone Edge right now. Uh, I do go ahead and shield one. Uh, I'm going to take one as well, but I do shield one. Um, and... This is going to be, uh, yeah, obviously it's going to be a Stone Edge now because it's a superpower. So I'm going to go ahead and throw the Shadow Ball. I wasn't confident that the Ominous Win would have KO'd. I don't think it would have. Uh, so Shadow Ball will be enough to pick up the knockout. Very nice. Uh, so out comes the Alga. Yeah, I just want to get to a Shadow Ball and I'm going to be able to get there. I do barely get there before my opponent can from down. You absolutely love to see it. Shadow Ball from Giratina Origin hits like an absolute truck. So that does a, a good chunk to the Dialga. Very nice, very nice indeed. So I'm going to bring in my own Diogo. My opponent switches to Ho-Oh. Uh, do I want to go for Draco? I do want to charge up for the Draco. I actually bait here uh, with the Iron Head. Expecting my opponent to shield this one up. And my opponent does shield. That is a Shadow. And I actually catch the move on Lugia. I wasn't really anticipating the catch. I was just trying to switch. But I catch anyway. Going to be a Sacred Fire. And I'm looking really good. I still have a shield. Uh, I'm going to be able to just throw a Sky Attack. Because this is a Shadow. So it doesn't have as much bulk. As it generally does, that is going to be enough to KO, and out comes Lugia. Uh, and I still have a shield. Lugia is so bulky, I can shield this one up. Do I shield this one up? I actually don't even shield it up. It does KO me, but I can farm down. I could have shielded it up to get off the Sky Attack as well. It doesn't really matter. Good game, well played to my opponent. This team worked out really well. I'm excited to try it again. Dialga into Kyogre, you absolutely love to see it. Great matchup. Uh, I do resist all the water attacks. Uh, out comes Dialga. So Dialga's safe swap is kind of tough. 
right? Usually what I do is I charge up. Sometimes I throw the Drago, sometimes I throw the Iron Head Bait. In this case, I'm throwing the Iron Head Bait because I can switch out. My opponent does shield, so I'm going to go ahead and go into Lugia. Um, and yeah, I mean, pretty good. I got it low. Yeah, again, this team kind of struggles against Dialga, I guess, in a way. But still, I'm going to go ahead and shield. It is the Draco. Very good shield by me. Because they threw a Draco, I think I could go for the farm down. My opponent is going to go ahead and go for an another attack. But I know... Well, actually, is it a Draco? It is a Draco. Never mind, that's right. I remember thinking it was an Iron Head, but it was actually a Draco. But I could take it because my opponent is was debuffed, right? So I do go ahead and farm down with Lugia. Very nice indeed. Got a lot of energy, shield to tie, out comes Kyoga. I should have thrown the Arrow Blast here, but I actually throw the Sky Attack, hoping they shield. Uh, I wasn't really expecting the shield, so I don't know why I didn't throw the Arrow I should have thrown the Arrow Blast, definitely a mistake on my end. Uh, but my opponent will take me out with Surf, so at least the energy comes out. I do go ahead and bring out this Diago right now. I'm going to go ahead and just throw the Iron Head before my opponent gets to a possible attack. I want to KO this... Uh, Kyoga, and it does KO, and I switch out, and it's Lugia. Um, this is not a one-sided matchup. I mean, the Dragon Tails are adding up. The Sky Attack will add up. Obviously, the Arrow Blast will just KO me after the Dragon Tails. But I'm going to be able to go for a Shadow Bolt anyway into the Lugia. My opponent will go ahead and shield that one up. My opponent gets off an attack. I know this is a Sky Attack, but I'm still going to go ahead and shield it. Uh, and there's the Sky Attack. I do go ahead and throw my Shadow Bolt right now. This Shadow Ball is coming out hot, and it's going to do a lot of damage. My opponent will get off that next Shadow Ball. I knew they had two Shadow Balls. Oh, not Shadow Balls, excuse me, Sky Attack, but it's not going to be enough to KO me. Uh, and I think I just found out we both, yeah, we both knock each other out, but I still have a Dialga in the back, so I did take that game, and that is going to be a great game, very well played to my opponent. Let's go ahead and move into the next battle. The uh, Zekra from my opponent, absolutely love to see it. Great matchup. My opponent switches into Mewtwo. I'm going to go ahead and go into my Giratina. Now, of course, I am counting uh, to see if they charge up enough for Shadow Ball or Ice Beam. But they both take seven, and it is a Shadow Ball, so that's a good shield by me. Uh, so now I can count and throw just before my opponent gets to a Sight Strike. I'm going to go ahead and throw this Shadow Ball, uh, and that Shadow Ball will KO. I'm just one wouldn't have KO'd, so. Zekrom coming in. I'm going to be able to throw a Shadow Ball into the Zekrom. Giratina Origin is so good. Uh, we do see a shield there, but that's totally fine. Uh, I could get to another one if my opponent goes for the farm down. My opponent is going to go ahead and throw. Nice counting by them. Going to go ahead and throw this attack. I think it's a crunch. It is. That will KO me, but that's totally fine. Um, I'm going to bring in Dialga. Out comes Groudon. Yeah, absolutely love to see it. Lugia walls Groudon, and my opponent will concede that game. And that's going to be a great game. Very well played to my opponent. Moving on. Dialga into Giratina. Absolutely love to see it. Great matchup, right? Uh, my opponent switches out into Z. Okay, <laughs> so Zacian is tough. I don't know the best way to play a safe swap Zacian. I go ahead and stay in for right now and throw this Iron Head to get a shield, but they actually don't shield. Maybe I should switch into Giratina right away. Maybe I should, because even if they have play rough, and most of them do have play rough, one play rough is not enough to KO me. Uh, so, I don't know, should I go into Giratina right away? Maybe. I am learning the Master League, as I've mentioned before, so it's okay. Um, if I go into Lugia, if they don't have Wild Charge, which most of them don't, that's good. But at the same time, Zacia double resist Dragon Tail. Is it? Which, what do you think? Let, chat, let me know in the comments down below. Not chat, this is not Twitch. But let me know in the comments down below what you think I should do. My opponent with that boost! But I can bring in the Dialga at least. My opponent's still going to go ahead and switch into the Excadrill. Kind of tough. Kind of tough, but my opponent's over farming. I am going to be able to go for the bait right now. Draco Media would KO, or almost KO, probably KO it. So, yeah, I think it would KO. So, I bring in Lugia. The beautiful thing about Lugia is you can take multiple Rock Slides. It's such a tank, right? Rock Slide doesn't even look like it's super effective. Lugia is just going to be able to take a couple more. I do take this one. Um, totally fine. And I'm trying to... Oh, I actually go for the Sky Attack. Interesting. Okay. I guess I did. I guess I wanted to get off the Tick Sky Attack before another attack. Oh no, because they have the shield, I guess. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. They have the shield, so I just do the Sky Attack to get off the damage. Uh, this Rock Slide would come very close to KOing me. I do go ahead and invest the shield. Uh, and it is a Rock Slide, obviously. My opponent is going to be able to throw another Rock Slide. Do I shield this one? I do. Because I still have that Dialga. And out comes the Giratina. I expected the switch, so I go ahead and hold my energy and switch into Diago. My opponent is going to go ahead and throw an attack. It's going to be a Shadow Ball. Uh, it is enough to KO me, but I do go ahead and 
bring in my Lugia. I'm going to go ahead and charge up as much as I can. And then throw the Sky Attack, which is going to be enough to KO. But I need to get to a Sky Attack. Is a Sky Attack enough to KO, though? I don't think it is. I remember this game. Sky Attack coming out. It lives on 1 HP. I get through a Dragon Tail. But no, my opponent gets off a Rock Slide. Good game. That will be enough to KO me. Well played. Well played. Good game. Good game. Uh, let's go ahead and move into the next battle. Here we go. Dialga into Dialga. Okay, you love to see the mirror match. Um, so, not really, but... Uh, let me know how you all play this matchup. Uh, usually I charge up to Draco and throw the Iron Head. I have thrown Draco before. I'm going to go ahead and throw the Iron Head this time. See if my opponent wants to shield. If they want to shield, I just let my Dialga go. And my opponent is going to go ahead and shield. Um, yeah, I just let my Dialga go. My opponent will uh, throw an Iron Head, and that will be enough to pick up the knockout. But that's totally fine. I bring in the Lugia. I go for the aggressive farm down. Uh, my opponent does make it to an attack, but should, uh, actually, I am afraid of the Draco, so I do go ahead and shield it. It is the Draco. Uh, so that's a good shield. At least I get energy on the Lugia. I do lose Switch, but out comes Giratina. So I'm going to go ahead and throw... What did I throw? I think I threw the Sky Attack bait. I did, and my opponent shields. Beautiful. Um, so that is good. Now I want to get to an Arrow Blast. I survive this Shadow Ball because Lugia is a monster. So Shadow Ball is coming out. But can I make it? I can make it because that Lugia is a monster. As I said, it's a bulky monster. So I do survive it. And that will be enough to KO. I'm going to switch out. Oh, you love to see it. Even if they have Blizzard, it doesn't matter because I have a shield, right? Good game. Well played to my opponent. Let's go ahead and move into the next battle. Dialga into Dialga. Another Dialga mirror match. Super common. Dialga is one of the most common, if not the most common, Pokemon in the Master League. Um, okay, I'm charging up. I go for the Iron Head. My opponent actually catches on Lugia, so if I threw the Draco, that would have been nice. But I did not. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and switch. Good catch by my opponent, but I do go ahead and switch into Giratina. The Giratina at least gets to avoid um, that Dialga, right? At least for now, I'm going to go ahead and throw the Shadow Ball. And... Okay, this is a Sky Attack. I'm just going to let this one go. And then I can go for the Farm Down, I think. I think I go for the Farm Down. Yeah, I definitely go for the Farm Down. Because even another Sky Attack wouldn't KO me. My opponent does have energy with that Dialga. And they're going to throw right away, which makes sense. However, I do live in Iron Head, if they throw an Iron Head. Uh, so I do live it, and I can get off the Ominous Win. Amazing, I get off that Ominous Win. Beautiful. Uh, so working out really well. Picking up a Shield as, as well, which is even better. Uh, do I bring in... Which one do I bring in? Let's find out. I think the Yaga. No, I bring in Lugia. Okay, I guess I want to get that fun. Uh, I think I think it makes sense to bring in the Lugia actually. Um, shield fun down is my goal, and it's going to be a Draco. So it's a beautiful shield. Expecting a switch, and it is a switch. It's going to be a Kyogre. I'm going to go ahead and go straight Arrow Blast right now, and this Arrow Blast is going to do massive, massive damage. But we see the shield. But I can always go ahead and go into my Dialga right now. Um, so do I shield this one up? I might shield this. I do because I want to get to a Draco to KO that Kyogre. Can I get to it? Can I get to it? No, I cannot get to it. Oh my gosh. This is going to be enough to KO me. Did I mess up this game? Let's find out. I'm going to go ahead and bring in the Lugia. A Surf will not KO me. A Surf will not KO me. If it's a Surf, it's not going to KO. If it's a Thunder, it's going to KO. It's a Surf. I survive it. And my opponent switches, trying to farm me down, but Lugia will not have any of it because of how bulky it is. And I go for the Arrow Blast to take out that Kyogre. Holy cow, what a game. Good game to my opponent. Absolutely insane. And that will be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate that. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good day. Uh, bye.